Shalom, shalom. Call hello, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakakwadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles at Great Millstone. Shalom to all you Akim out there pushing and laboring in this truth. So I'm going to start off um, this video with one scripture, Job 4 and 7. Remember, I pray thee, whoever perished being innocent, or where were the righteous cut off? Even as I have seen, they that plow iniquity and sow wickedness reap the same. So um, this is going to be a little um, lesson on Esau Edom, right? And how he received this kingdom, right? Through blood, deceit, lies, you name it. All wickedness, right? In order to have this so-called great kingdom, America, right? And and, and the Lord is going to judge him for that, right? Uh, this is Ecclesiasticus 10 and 8. Because of unrighteous dealings, injuries and riches got by deceit the kingdom is translated from one people to another right esau edom snuck his way into rulership right we, we were dying out because we went off right he rounded everybody up came over here to the americas murdered millions and millions of the tribe of gad and claimed this land for himself right so you have to re really remember like who, who our enemy is. Let me get that now, right? He's our enemy, the murderer. It says, this is uh, Ecclesiasticus. Uh, I'll start at 10. Never, uh, this is uh, Ecclesiasticus 12 and 10. Never trust thine enemy. For like as iron rusteth, so is his wickedness, right? So we already know the so-called white man, Esau Edom, is the devil. You can't trust him, right? If you get sick, you can't take his prescriptions, can't take his pain medicine, right? All of that is, is, is going to destroy you from the inside. Everything that he has in this system, in this, in, in this kingdom, is meant to destroy and, and so oppress you, children of Israel, right? The Israelites, to stay in power, to keep you docile. That's why it's fluoride in the water. That's why it's chemtrails in the sky. That's why it's GMOs in the food, right? Even though the devil was cursed and, and he can't till the ground, right? That's why he uses GMO because he, he, he can't use the ground in the soil like we can, right? He was cursed by uh, the Most High Yahweh by Shem Yahushai for slaying his brother Abel, right? Cain, the spirit of Cain. He says, though he humble himself and go crouching, yet take good heed and beware of him, and thou shalt be unto him as if thou hast wiped a looking glass, right? If you look in, in the mirror and you move around in the mirror, right? Every movement <laughs> is completely precise, Right. You can't get around looking in the mirror like, hey, I'm what every move you make. I'm on it. <laughs> it says, and thou shalt be unto him as if thou has wiped a looking glass. Right. Thou and thou and thou shalt know that his rust hath not been altogether wiped away. So, you know, hey, at the end of the day, you're going to know that this devil is going to be the damn devil, man. He's going to be Satan. Right. Um, so we have to separate, right? We have to separate from, from this, this devil, Esau, Edom. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get this right. We already know Esau is the devil. We already know he's the wicked, right? This is Malachi one and four. Whereas Edom saith, we are impoverished, but we will return and build the desolate places. Thus saith Yahweh of hosts, they shall build, but I will throw down, and they shall call them the border of wickedness, right? The people against whom Yahweh hath indignation forever. And your eyes shall see, and ye shall say, Yahweh will be magnified from the border of Israel, right? So he only Israel is going to have the name of the Most High, right? The, the Israelites. That's why nobody else has this name. 
If you ask anybody, yo, what's the name of the most high? They're going to say Yahweh or Jehovah, right? Um, Yah, right? No one has the correct name, but uh, the, the men of Great Millstone and down, right? And the people who follow Great Millstone. That's it. Yahweh, the father, Yahweh Shai, the son, and Rakak would dodge the spirit, man. Ain't no getting around it. And it says we will uh, build the desolate places, right? So this is Job chapter 3, verse 14. With kings and counselors of the earth, which build desolate places for themselves, or with princes that had gold, who filled their houses with silver, right? So the kings and, and counselors of this earth built the desolate places who built the desolate places malachi one and four edom esau edom right and they stock they stocking up on gold and filling their houses with silver right but what does the lord say right uh this is yeah this is uh isaiah chapter 49 verse 22 thus saith yahweh power behold i will lift up mine hand to the Gentiles and set my standard to the people and they shall bring thy sons and in their arms and thy daughters shall be carried upon their shoulders and kings shall be thy nursing fathers and their queens thy nursing mothers they shall bow down to thee with their face towards the earth and lick the dust of thy feet and thou shalt know that I am Yahweh, for they shall not be ashamed that wait for me. So we got to wait on the Lord, man. Waiting on the Lord, we're going to be, bro, the Lord, Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, he's literally going to round all of these Edomites up, right? All of the heathen nations up. And, and they're going to literally lick the dust off of our feet. They're going to be so grateful just to not be dead. And, and, and to lick the dust off of the elect's feet, man. Right? But he says we have to wait for him. You can't be impatient in this, right? Patience is suffering. We have to suffer the the um the time appointed for the Gentiles, man. We have to suffer. But in the meantime, we're gonna prophesy and, 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 and tell these heathens, hey, your judgment is coming. Get ready, right? So um, this is, I'm going to read this first, Isaiah 26 and 20. Come, my people, enter into thy chambers and shut thy doors about thee. Hide thyself as it were for a little moment until the indignation be overpassed, right? So he's saying like, yo, come back to these lost commandments. Praise me. Follow Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, right? And don't look back. Until hey, until I'm done wreaking my wrath on all these two thirds, right? The heathen and everybody else, right? Verse twenty one. For behold, Yahweh cometh out of his place to punish the inhabitants of the earth for their iniquity. The earth also shall disclose her blood and shall no more cover her slain, right? So hey, when when somebody dies, what happens? You um you bury them right, put them in a grave, give them a little tombstone. You mourn right. It says the earth also shall disclose her blood, and shall no more cover her slain. So there, a hey, there's gonna be dead bodies everywhere, man. Right, dead bodies all over the place, just laying on the ground. You a hey, dead bodies is gonna be the new thing, the new sight, right? Everywhere. Uh, this is Psalms 96 and 2. Sing unto Yahweh, bless his name. Show forth his salvation from day to day. Declare his glory among the heathen, his, war, his wonders among all people. For Yahweh is great and greatly to be praised. He is to be feared among all gods. For all the gods of the nations are idols, but Yahweh made the heavens. So, that goes to show you whatever anybody in this world is worshiping is fake, man. It's idols, right? Vanity, right? 
Ain't nobody in this world praising the, the, the one true living God but the men of GMS on down, man. Right? If you following the doctrine of GMS, Great Millstone, calling on the name Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, right? You're not praising the Most High, man. You're not praising um, um, the only living God, the only living power. You're 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 um worshiping idols, right? So um I think that's it that I have. Yeah. So basically all I'm saying is, you know, we gotta we gotta come back to the most high, man. We gotta come back to these laws, statutes, commandments in the Bible, right? Thus saith the how about how shy. So with that, all praises, glory, and honor. Goes to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash, Shalom.